Vamos a hacer van, pues el por aquí. Ok, let us understand what does question number 40 say? Total circles, class length. This is good for uh, CBSE, but also this is good for ICSE board also. This is good for IDCSE board also. So all the boards are covered because all the boards will be playing circles problem. Okay, so let us try to understand this problem, Mr. CD. A triangle ABC is inscribed in the circle, so this is the inscribed triangle ABC, the bisectors of triangle BAC, BAC, ABC, and ACG lead the circle circle of the triangle and PQR. So basically, what you need to understand is that this angle, this angle, this angle gets bisected by this line. Similarly, this gets bisected by this line. This angle gets bisected by this line and of course all the angles of bisect angle bisecting we can this one this is one are we clear till here yes so this is one of the difficult uh, questions in circles okay let us try to understand now what we need to prove is that angle abc a b c this angle is twice of atq a b q basically you have to draw a line like this like this, and then you'll have to prove that ABC ABC is twice of A B Q. The same, Mr. Saman, do we agree? Yes, sir. Uh, any idea how this can be done? Uh, so, first of all, uh, we can draw a chord A Q. We, we can line, uh, we can draw a line from A to Q. What next? And uh, angle APQ is equal to angle ABQ. So if this is the chord, this would be one of the angle which would be formed, and this chord would be making another angle ABQ. This angle. This angle. This angle would also be theta. Do we agree? Yes, yes sir. Uh, this angle is equal to this angle because BQ is the angle by six. Oh, agree? yes, yes. Do we agree? Yes, yes sir. And that is why APQ, APQ, this angle, APQ. A, let me write it here. APQ. Now APQ, if you have understood, APQ is also equal to ABQ and also equal to QBC. Do you agree? Yes. So, in short, what you are trying to say is that angle APQ is actually half of angle ABC. Do, do we agree to this? Yes, sir. Is it making sense or not? Yes, yes sir, it is making sense. Great. Okay, so this is what we have proved. Now this part. ACB, basically, ACB, this whole angle, is twice of ABR. A P R. You'll have to join this line. And what you need to prove is that this is twice of A P R. Okay. Any idea how should we do? So angle E C V and uh, A P R. So similarly, we can draw a chord from R to A and. Uh, Angle APR will be equal to angle ACR. And because line RC is a angle bisector, so therefore uh, angle ACR will be equal to angle RCB. So again, like we had done the previous question, this question again, what we need to understand is in all these equations, 
uh, sorry, in all these questions, it is very uh, it is very important that you are able to see the lines and the chords and the angles. So these are very difficult questions. Success is one of the very difficult questions in um, class 10 class. But that is why you need to do a lot of practice for such questions so that you start seeing the angles and the diameters and the cyclic coordinates. Because without practice, uh, this becomes a difficult topic. Okay, so what you have suggested, what you have suggested is that if we take this chord AR, basically what you were saying is that if this is the chord, this chord will make the same angle here as well as here. These two angles will be equal. Mr. C B do we agree? Yes, sir. So that is why what you are suggesting is that if we take AR to be the chord and ACR, angle ACR, angle ACR, would be equal to angle APR, do we agree? Yes. And what we are very well aware is that ACR, ACR is equal to angle RCP, is equal to angle RCP. Do we agree? Yes. So basically, this is theta. This angle is also theta. And this angle is also theta. Do we agree? Yes. Now, that is why, if you have understood the logic, that APR, angle APR, would actually be this APR. This APR would actually be half of. This whole angle, A, C, D. Do we agree? Yes. And this can also be written as, this can also be written as, the twice of APR would be equal to A, C, D. Do we agree? Yes, sir. So, these two questions are the same. Do you see any doubt earlier? No, no. So, the third part is, uh, once you are comfortable till here, I'll just review what we have done till here because this is one of the tricky questions. So basically, we started with this chord, AQ chord. We were we took this to be angle X. This was X, therefore this was X, and this was X. This is one part. The second part that we did was we took this to be the chord. Once we took this to be the chord, then this angle Z. Is equal to this angle bit, is equal to this angle bit. This is one we agree. Yes, sir. Okay. So, this is what we do in the first two part. This is what is written here also. Now, let us try to understand what is required to be done in the third part. Okay. So, <coughs> QPR is QPR. I have assumed the angle to be X and Z. So, Q bar. QPR consists of Q and Z. So Q, uh, sorry, X plus Z. Now X plus Z, this X plus Z is half of angle ABC, AB. This X, this X is half of angle AC, ACB. So the series is making sense or not? Yes, yes sir. This X is half of A, B, C, half of A, B, C. This Z is half of A, C, B, to be agreed. Yes, sir. X plus Z, X plus Z is equal to half of A, B, C plus half of A, C, B. Is it making sense? Yes, sir. So basically, in short, we have shifted from here to here. Do you agree? Yes. yes, sir. Okay. So now look at half of ABC and half of ACB. This X to Z is half of ABC and AC. Now I take, once I take the half out, it will be ABC plus ACB. ABC plus ACB. Is it making sense? Yes. So what is ABC? 
add a c d it is 180 degree minus twice how long what is y y is this any doubt no no see what you need to understand is that this is the angle by sector and the triangle that I have assumed the triangle that I have assumed a b c this angle is 2y this angle is 2x and this angle is 2z read out in this no no so let us try to tackle this this is 180 minus 2y so this will be equal to 90 minus y are we okay till here yes you look closely what is y what is y y is half of b is sorry b a c is it making sense yes yes so y is half of b is and that is what is written here therefore q p r is a 90 minus half of b a c and if you are wondering why am i proving this because this is what is required Yes, sir. Have you understood this question or not? Yes, sir. Yeah, I think third or fourth time I'm repeating this that this is one of the tricky questions. So you'll have to take this to be the chord, you'll have to take this to be the chord, you'll have to find a relationship, and then once you have derived the relationship, you'll have to come here. Using the relationship that you have derived in part one and part two, you'll have to reach here. And then what you will focus for the third part of the question is you'll have to focus on this triangle. Mr. C D, have you understood it or not? Yes. So what I request is just do this question again. One of the good questions, one of the difficult 